Ooh. Oh, not on yet. Oh, now we're on. Oh, Sacramento in five, five, nine, two, oh, nine, two, one, oh. We still the show. Welcome, five, nine. Welcome, Welcome to the Freddie and Paul show. Yes, San Diego or something. Who's five, oh, nine? I don't know. 559 is my show, you sir. The oh, people, they, did you just oh, give people your cell phone number? They're looking out. No, I didn't. They're looking out <laughs> for you, Charles. You're looking out for me? I asked them if they saw us on, on YouTube, my my family and my cellular, the Youngs. And they said, yeah, they, we want to see that guy get down and do a shin dig down there. Okay. Well, we'll see so about that later we're on. We're seeing about that. So say yeah, hi to Say hi to I'm about to say, how you doing? This is my boy, man. Hi, Sacramento, we California. Where are you from? Man. Sacramento, man. Oakland. Uh, what about E40? Yeah, there you go. Fairfield, E40. Yeah. You're my, fa- my Facebook Paul, page. Paul, too. Paul, I got comments with you rapping. They said, when is Paul going to do a dance? Yeah. I'm not kidding. The pastor dance? Yeah. That'd, that'd be different. That would be different, man. Ah, oh, oh, you missed it. I like it. I saw it. When's Paul gonna do a dance? He got and, and, and this man over here, he put Mr. Paul put me, chemo, and dog bark on a channel, and he put Paul put it too. up, and Paul's been branding too at the end of each. Ready yeah. and show. He put Charles, Charles was on the one I played before. He wasn't that. dancing or singing or anything. He was at the uh, stagecoach. So. Okay. Oh, okay. And the A's won last night, and the Giants won. So that's a good Father's Day present. Uh, good Father's Day present. I'm gonna turn off the air conditioner. Just All right, no we can, you keep that. talking, Fred. Mm. And uh, Dave likes the A's better than the Giants, right, Dave? Oh, I don't like any of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Wow. Dave doesn't like any of them. That's okay. Open A's. Well, Mom likes the A's. Open A's. Mom, you couldn't make it today. Niners, the Bears. Uh, she said she, she mm-hmm. said, I don't know what that was. We need that. That's up. She so said real. some. she said that she was uh, not feeling well, Paul, but she'll be here next week, she said. Okay. And I'm going to go over there today, later today, and mow her lawn. Okay. <laughs> and then I'm going to do what I got to do. Have fun. There you go. Good day. Um, basically, what I'm saying is, as Dave's going to do his music first, and I'll just, me and Charles will finish ours off when he's done. But I'm going to sing with Dave. Okay. You want us to repeat you, right, well, sir? You, wanted, you also wanted to know, Fred, what we could do on the show oh, to yeah, break yeah, things yeah. up. You want to do some other things. Yeah. To say a topic about politics. Oh, uh, Freddie wants to talk about politics. What should we talk about? Uh, Trump. Well, I'm talking about Donald Trump. Trump. Indicted. Yeah, he got indicted. He got but convicted. Now they're letting him, yeah, but now they're letting him slide and he might be the president again. <laughs> what happened to Kanye West? What, what happened to Kanye, Kanye West? He's not in the news anymore. A long time ago, we were talking about Kanye. For president? And I thought he should have been president. Oh, Kanye hey. West would have been good. Yeah. He would have been, been good in the birthday party. Yeah, I don't know if they <laughs> thought he would have been good, but they think he's confused already. Really? Right? Yeah, so. Oh, you know, I'm a fan. Don't no, get it wrong. I'm a Kanye West fan, but I, the president is a high status. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't Maybe know. I, I haven't him. heard Kanye. Kanye said he was going to run for 2024, but he hasn't seemed to throw his hat in the ring ever since he lost his marriage. I think things have kind of gone downhill for him. I think she brought some stability to him. Well, which you want to check us out? Hold the line, too. Paul, one thing is for sure: if the fans want to check us out and they're out of Sacramento, they can go to Old Sacramento on a Thursday and meet us down there. And they can tell all their friends and they can watch us because we legally can do that now. I asked and they said, yes, you can do that. Okay. And So Thursday is the day to see you every guys. Every Thursday at around 1 o'clock, right? 1 o'clock. Right, Dave? Well, I'm there at 10.30 for breakfast. He's at 10.30, yeah. But not me because I'm afraid of D and I get laid a little watch because I get it shiggity. Anyway. <laughs> You get some pursuit of the dance. So Thursday, friends. Thursday between 10.30 and 2, you can bump into Freddie and Dave down at Old Sack and they're recording and videos. on a Saturday once in a great while. All right. Or we're going to the ball game when Bowtie comes yeah, up, Yeah, that's right? going to be fun. Mm-hmm. 
And we might, I might as well tell you, me, Dave, Bowtie, and Charles are going to be doing music together. All right, I'll, I'll, too. I'll, I'll bring something to record Chemo it with. Too. We'll take me out to the ball game. game. Go silly. No, no, no. I'm saying we're going to put out an album. Oh, oh. We're, trying to, we're trying to write some music. I don't know an album, but write some music. I've written some like on vinyl? Time. No. <laughs> that'd be nice. On a computer. Yeah, uh, multi. Oh. Yeah, that, that vinyl is kind of expensive to do something. Yeah, that'd be nice, too, to put something on outro vinyl. That's coming back now. It's making a big time. What they do do vinyl now. It's coming. It's making a comeback. It's making a comeback. Like it Taylor is, Swift, her new album, her new record came out on vinyl. Yeah, oh, no. Yeah, it made it come back. Yeah. Okay, okay for Paul, the DJs. Paul, I need you to get a hold of Jimmy That's what Kimmel, I you know. okay? You want me to get a hold of Jimmy Kimmel? Yeah, let me, Kimmel, let me, so we can go on the show. We can go down there and be on his show. Let me email so, Jimmy a minute and say Freddie right. wants on the show. Okay. I'm sure that'll get us on there. Ah, Paul. You have to be out here, though, first, <laughs> as an artist. Anyway. You can it in. And Nina's over there shaking her head at you, Freddie. <laughs> you got a head shaking for that one. Jimmy okay. Kimmel live. Jimmy Kimmel live. We love Jimmy Kimmel live. What else? Okay. What other politics can you come up with? What other politics can I come up with? Yeah. I, you think yeah. politics is the right thing for this show? No, yeah. not really. No, I think you should stick with guys. Because we've had Jane Fonda for president. We've Didn't had we Kanye West, West for president. Uh, We're just a presidential nomination candidate. Uh, yeah. yeah. And don't nobody care about nothing lately. What's that? You know what you can do. Uh, you know what you can do. No, it's just what you can do. Yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. Will be a good one in time. This is time about politics. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Let's talk. All right. No politics. All right. It's your turn, Dave. To shine. Oh, you so like politics? It's your you turn to shine. Are you ready, Dave? Dave? Okay. Oh, we yeah. gotta talk, Charles. About this guy went uh, old Sacramento. He tore it up, man. Please. He played a harmonica. He's already a star. Jamming, man. He's already a star. Yeah. He's already a star. Go ahead, man. Star. All right. Star of God. Okay.
Beautiful. Very nice. <laughs> nice job. All right. I guess we got some Freddy coming here. All right. Breed beats that are royalty free. No advertisements. Good luck on that one, though. No advertisements. Either. I'm afraid you got to have this stuff set up. I know, but he was going too. and uh, I. You should have been yeah, like said. Keep this talking, Dave. Just think of Oh, something. yeah. Uh, we had a good sermon today. Yeah, uh, he has to do the sermon. Okay, oh, Dave's yeah, got to do a sermon report. Well, well, tell us about the sermon, Dave. What'd you think well, of the sermon? I thought it was dynamite. Uh, we're still in the book of Acts, and Paul, uh, Apostle, is uh, taking some trips uh, to do some missionary work, even though he's actually supposed to be in prison, and he's been in prison a lot. He's uh, now going to transfer over to Rome, get his head cut off, I guess. But uh, no, he's going to go over there. He wants, to, he wants to witness to Caesar himself. And God said, you're going to do it, Paul. You're going to go there, and you're going to witness for me to Caesar himself. And so he takes his boat trip, and man, what a story about this boat. Uh, they had all kinds of troubles and everything, and... And Luke, I guess, was on board, apparently. He was writing all this down, and, and uh, we, he got the recollection of, of having done this thing with Paul and, and how it worked out really cool. And, um, and, and nobody on the ship, uh, the sh I mean, they went out in kind of a bad time where the, where the storms was going after the ships, but, but, um, but then their ship got it bad, and they got all beat up. They throw in everything overboard, and... Uh, but uh, God told Paul the apostle that uh, they're not going to lose any life if they stay with the ship. Thank you. And uh, so that was his, his thing. Nobody can escape on the lifeboat. Nobody's going to do nothing, but nobody's going to kill the prisoners. Uh, because, you know, if you lose a prisoner and you're a guard in the Roman thing, that means you die. And Ooh. so they didn't want to lose any prisoners, so they thought they Are might as well stay? kill them all. They thought they might as well kill them all because, heck, they're all doomed anyway, right? Good. So, uh, but, but, the, the, but the, the captain, I think it was, uh, said, he, no, he wants to keep Paul. And uh, so they kept Paul, and, and uh, they were going for days and days and days. They didn't see the sun. They didn't see any stars, no nothing. And um, finally Paul says... Uh, after so many days, he said, okay, people, uh, God told me, you know, if we can stick with the ship and, and do this thing that you guys will not lose your life, you're going to be okay. But um, uh, you got to stay with it. And, uh, and so he said, go ahead and eat something. We haven't been eating anything for days and days and days and days. So let's eat something now, because you're going you're gonna to be swimming here pretty quick. <laughs> uh, and you, you're going to need some strength. And, uh, and if you can't swim, you're going to have to hang on to some of those boards from the ship. That is, the ship's breaking up on the, if it breaks up on the sandbar, which it did, there's going to be pieces of boards you could hang on to. And, and everybody's going to get to land. Everybody's got to be safe. And so... Uh, it's not going to be like the Titanic, Dave. Titanic, no Titanic? No Titanic. Mm. Okay, we're good. We're good. Titanic, yeah, though. this, uh, I don't know if this is any better than that, but. Everybody did, actually. But they, yeah, they should make a good movie out of this one. It's Maybe they have. Yeah, I don't uh, know. The, um, uh, so that's basically the sermon.
And I got out of it. Good job, right. Dave. Thank you for doing that. I appreciate that. You're doing a good well. job, man. I miss All right, we're going to flow a little <laughs> bit here. I'm going to get this flow dropping. It's it's taking its time. Oh, here we go. All right. Back to commercial. Commercial. We got an ad. Here we go. Here we go. All right. What's up, y'all? In the party place to be. I'm going to sing a song called Give Me Jesus. Here it goes. Okay, but he's funny anyway. Did you hear that singing? <laughs> Captain Morgan, the Charles J, here today. In God we pray, in God we trust every day as we lay. Captain Morgan is here for all of the shows. Now, as we stay here with Pastor Paul and Dog Bark, we are the crew. I thought you knew we get down every day, today, each and every day. We come your way as a the showtime at the Apollo. No, my name is not Apollo. <coughs> nephew, who I do have as my nephew. The C H A R L E S. I'm the best. Always, we all confess that Jesus Christ is the best. Don't settle for less. I don't shop at pay less. Pay less. Okay, <laughs> I'm leaving just like that. A nephew to the chat. His stuff is fat. Captain Morgan, I'm not whack. How deep Bob's love for us. How vast beyond measure that it shall be only son to make a wretch a treasure read. How great pain of searing loss. The father turns into his face away as his wounds are bare chosen one. Bring many sons of glory. Behold the man upon a cross. My sin upon the shoulders, 
a shame I hear my mocking voice call out among the scopers. It was the sin that held him there until he was accomplished. His dying breath has brought me, and I know he is finished. Like the world is diminished. We're always in this land to pray to God in command. Straight to you, out the screen, coming on the mic. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, dancing you time. Dancing. You dancing. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Here we go. Uh oh. Don't want any lunar landings. <laughs> All right, tell me when you're ready. I'm ready, Fred. All right, here we go. Ready for Freddy. No moonshine. <laughs> Woo! Fred too, yeah. Fred Senior. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, I gotta make this up. Mm -hmm. I'll be okay. I just gotta get it. Come on. Is this your own words? Yeah. Not AI. No. <laughs> All right, here we go. Turn it down a little bit. All right, here we go. Fred Schuler. Junior, my father, my ace boom coon. I hope you're up in heaven doing it, not in the saloon. But yo, hitting softballs out the park after dark. We went to Giants games, and he could have been in the Hall of Fame. A's, Kings, you name it, we were in the ring doing our thing. Charles Chase remembers my dad. He was the one, and he wasn't Sinbad. Doing the trick, but he was so funky, he came with it. He liked to smoke salmon 
and I ain't even lying because Pastor Paul had some slamming. <laughs> doing it tight, doing it right. Jesus Christ is the one, and he's always got the insight for you and me. My father was so cool, G. He was always there. He'll never put you in despair. He'll make you laugh. He'll make you be in the mix. And that's all, but yo, Pastor Paul knows my father, and that ain't all. He's a good man in command. Charles J. rough about my father, man. That's all right, Father Fred. Fred Schuler, Sr. Yes, that's my people's. He's like my other father, and of course, my own father, Charles Jennings Sr. That is my seniors now. They're both my seniors. Charles, the French jeweler, the most driving one to keep us driving, like our, he was like our limousine driver. That's our people. He was always there. We go everywhere with him. That's not a lie, actually. So, people was always with Fred. The mom and him, and we just like had fun all the time. Now my dad was who would call you look jive turkey, and he, he smoked them turkeys like Captain Morgan. That's my dad. He had those big battle tape Cadillacs. He had them tight hats, as I probably why I like to wear the hats with the slacks and the pants. You got rated hat? PG. <laughs> Trust me. And I guess that's it. Red love, I'm back again to my father. He don't sin. He's the man in command. Never sin. Fred Senior, and I'm the third. I'm on the mic, and that ain't absurd. Word up to my brothers and my folks. That's right. I don't think you want to take a toke to this industry, because it's hard being Freddie, Freddie D. I somehow, some way, we come up raps every single day. I will dance, I will prance. We're gonna land the plane and that's that. But Father, happy Father's Day. And I love you and that's what we do. We gotta pray just to make it today. One love. Amen.